art story. Um, I'm basically just teaching you guys how to curl my hair. Do I need to know this? <laughs> Is this a hair tutorial? Curling iron works too. Why are you showing me this? Part, that's what makes your hair like fat at the end, like how it like sticks up. So I recommend not using that. Um, I don't think she has any idea what she's doing. Worst hair tutorial ever. <laughs> This is such such great use of everyone's time on the internet. There and bring it like the middle of your finger, and then like do it like this, and then like wrap it around. Who makes a video of themselves curling their hair anyway? I see why this has so many views. Count twenty. Count the twenty. Count twenty or longer. Okay, <laughs> or longer. Excuse me. I see smoke. Oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my, oh. Did you just burn off? <laughs> that, that made this video so worth watching. <laughs> Poor thing. Girl, you better get a haircut. Look at her face. I feel so bad for laughing, but it's so funny. This is the best tutorial ever. My hair was burnt off. My hair burnt off. <laughs> oh, that's great. It's any girl's worst nightmare. You know what? I was actually going to, you know, follow her tutorial, but now I don't think I'm going to. So what happened in the video? Poor girl was doing a tutorial on how to curl your hair with a wand, and then it burned her hair off. Her hair burned off. The girl is trying to show her friends how to curl her hair, but uh, needs to learn how to curl her hair instead. At first, I thought it was a magic trick, to be honest. I was like, she made it disappear. But then, I realized it wasn't. How would you describe her reaction? She was like purely horrified, awestruck, flabbergasted. She was like, What just happened? It took her like a minute and a half to like realize. It's like, wait, wait, wait. How would you have reacted if you burned your hair off? I would have started crying. I probably would have been crying. Well, I've just cut it. I'm a guy. I don't care. I'll go short. Depends which part of my life I was at. If I was like five, I would have been like, my hair burned off, yes! Be honest, has something like this ever happened to you? I don't think so. Oh, I've burned myself really badly. Like, right here. I mean, I've burned my finger. I've mean, burnt my hair before, but it's never burnt off. One time, I was straightening my bangs, and it was for a dance, and it was really, like, I was so excited for it, and then I burned the top of my forehead, and it was just, like, a red line. It was so embarrassing. I was putting red in my hair, so it would come out red, and I put it in, and it seriously came out looking like Charizard. Do you have any pictures of you like this? Yeah, I do. <laughs> it's so neon orange. Why? Do girls use products that literally can burn their hair off? You don't have to, but like, if you want to look cute. If you're like me, my hair is half straight and half curly. It just doesn't work. For the men, you have to look good for them. You can't be sloppy and like gross. You have to look good. You gotta do what you gotta do to be beautiful, I guess. <laughs> I mean, this is just all natural, you know? When you're on a show, they always have them in the hair room and things like that. I see steam off their hair and I'm like, ah, ah, cause I, I, I'm scared of curling irons. Like you get sick of it, so you just kind of try other stuff, and that other stuff sometimes burns you. It's the same thing with boys. Like when you're shaving, you can cut yourself. If it makes you feel better about yourself, do it. Fine, that's okay. But don't do it for another person. Do it for yourself. So do you think it's fair that society has done this to girls, while guys pretty much don't have to deal with this at all? <laughs> well, no, but society's not fair. Yes. Yes, it's totally fair. No, it's not fair at all. We literally have to do a hundred times more things than boys do. The only thing they have to do is like make the first move. They have to like ask the girl on the date. And sometimes they don't even do that. Sometimes we have to do that. I wish that like no one ever invented like anything to like do your hair and makeup because then we'd never have to do it and it'd be so much easier. But now that it's there, it's like you kind of have to do it. It's not, but that's why girls are better looking. Anyway, like I'm not like lesbian or anything. But I mean, I think girls are better looking most of the time because they actually try. Back to the video. If this happened to you, would you have uploaded the video? Oh, I didn't even think of that. She uploaded that herself. <laughs> Why would she do that? Oh my gosh, heck no. I wouldn't upload it to the internet so people can laugh at my pain. I might have put it like 
on Facebook or something so if my friends could see it. I would have. That would have been hilarious. <laughs> I'm gonna go home and curl my hair. Of course I wouldn't because it's gold. It's brilliant. No matter what happens, you still upload. You commit to uploading. So what do you think then of this girl for deciding to upload it? <laughs> she's got some big balls. I think she's a masochist. Well that takes guts, but also Thank you for sharing it with the world. So this video has over 25 million views so far. What? Oh my gosh. And she's even gotten over 30,000 subscribers off of this video. Why? Just for burning a piece of her hair. I mean, anyone can do that. Why are people subscribing after watching this? Maybe because they felt so bad for her. They're probably hoping she'll do it again. Waiting for her to burn her hair off or something again, or shave her an eyebrow, I don't know. If she does something else stupid, they want to be there first. Finally, what advice do you have for her with her new YouTube fame? Do not start vlogging. Sing or something, just don't do tutorials anymore. Take that fame and then turn it into something good. I hope she doesn't purposely end up hurting herself more to keep her subscribers or anything. I think that she should do normal ones and maybe throw like one that goes wrong in there like randomly sometimes so it's not like pr on purpose. She should make a video putting on makeup and the makeup should melt her face off. Bam. 20 million hits right there. I hope you enjoyed this episode of Teens React. Let us know what videos we should watch next. There are new reacts every Sunday so be sure you subscribe. What did the peanut say to the walnut? Give up? I'll catch you later. <laughs> All right, peace, guys. I'll see you later. Thanks for having me on the show again, guys. You are awesome. The things that happened in this video were attempted by non-professionals, so please don't do it at home. Do it at your friend's house.